National Combat Aircraft, MMU, KAAN, passed its first ejection seat test. For tests carried out in the UK, TAI sent the front part of the KAAN fighter jet to that country. Regarding this issue, TUSA General Manager, Prof. Dr. In Temel Kotal's statement, KAAN is undergoing mechanical tests. We continue with the calendar. As our president said, we will make the first flight this year. We bought the ejection seats from England. The test was carried out in England. We built the initial part of KAAN and sent it there to use in testing. The first launch has been carried out, the second launch will be carried out. This way, God forbid, if something goes wrong while flying, our pilot will be saved. This program continues as is. Everyone was very excited. The company that serves us is also working. Our words are our words, may God give us the ability to keep them, statement is included. When asked about the export performance of the company and the sector, Temu Kotil reminded that he is also the chairman of the board of directors of the Association of Defense and Aerospace Industry Exporters, and said that the increase in the export performance of the sector continues, and that the figure will be around $6 billion this year. Stating the same situation also applies to TAI, Kotil said. We signed a lot of contracts. The increase in forward orders in this country is much higher than what we can provide in production. There are very good orders coming to Turkey for the next three to four years. When we achieve this, we will be looking at, say, $20 billion in three years. If we look at $20 billion, Turkey F becomes a world player in the defense industry. If we look at the ratio of exports to imports, our exports are twice as high as imports. Turkey is in a positive position in the defense industry. The date for fulfilling the initial requirements, called T-0 National Combat Aircraft KAAN, is 2018. Within the scope of Phase 1, Khan's initial design activities were carried out between 2018 to 2022. Within the scope of Phase 1 Phase 2, Detailed design and qualification activities for the Khan MMU will be carried out in the 2022-2029 period. In this direction, KAAN, it leaves the hangar in 2023. It is targeted to produce three prototypes in 2026. The Block 10 configuration that will be handed over to the Air Force Command is targeted to be developed in 2029. The 10 TFX Block 1 fighter jets that will be produced within the scope of Phase 2 will be delivered to the Turkish Air Force between 2030 to 2033. However, the date announced by the Turkish Air Force was revised by TAI to 2028. Within the scope of Phase 3 between 2034 to 2040, other TFX block development and mass production activities will be carried out. This date was revised by TAI to 2030.